Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we are going to be playing some more Hypixel Skyblock. So, in the last episode, we did some more stuff. Derpy is now the mayor, and we did get ourselves to enchanting level 50. We are now at enchanting 51, which is, like, pretty cool, honestly. Like, we also got ourselves a Melon Dicer, which is right here. So, like, that's going to be our new tool for farming melons. For now, our Advanced Guarding Axe is going to be for Pumpkins and later on Cocoa Beans, which I haven't started actually farming yet, but, like, I probably should. I also don't have a gemstone in the advanced guarding axe, but, like, I probably should, like, go ahead and, like, add one right away. So, like, yeah. One thing I noticed is that the gold minion and the redstone minions have ran out of hyper catalyst. So, we're going to go ahead and get some more real quick just to make sure they have full power. And we are back to 83 million coins, so we're back to being pretty much rich again. So, like, that's pretty cool, right? Yeah, we're just going to buy 12 hyper catalysts for now. Just so that we can have, like, four in each minion. So, yeah, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then we're just going to each put them in there. So, yeah, this one gets four. This one already has one, but we're just going to add four anyway. And this one gets four. So, yeah, we're, we're going to go and collect. I did get my Swordfish level 100 off camera, which is, like, pretty cool, honestly. So, now we do have two level 100 pets. And, like, we're on our way to getting our Rabbit to level 100 and hopefully eventually my Enderman. And my, my transfer is at 68, but, like, I don't know. So, like, yeah, let's go ahead and collect from the Redstone minion and the other Redstone minion right now. And there we go. We also unlocked our Titanic accessory bag upgrade. So you have an almost max. So like eventually you don't have to put Hyper Catalyst in these minions anymore. And if anything, we probably could also like take them down too. Because our accessory bag is close to like being maxed. So like we actually have like so many more slots now. We can fit 1, 2, 3, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 more talismans in there now. So like we have plenty of space. But I'm going to have to wait until Derby's not the mayor anymore. Just so I can get most of those talismans. Because I mean he closed the auction house. So yeah. One thing I could do, though, is that I have some Enchanted Redstone blocks. We're going to try to make the personal compactor 7,000, which requires um, 56, so I'm going to need 45 more. 1.1 mil? Oh, that's actually cheaper than I thought it would be. But yeah, we got 56 now. So we're going to get not only more slots in our personal compactor, but also we're going to get more magical powers. Dang, okay, so we get a ton more slots. I think that's 5 more. Alright, that's really cool, honestly. So I went from 7 to 12. So yeah, there we go. So that's gonna be more magic power. Went from four 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 to four four eight. So that's gonna be pretty good for us, right? We also could make an, a jar mule like talisman or something. Which I think all we need is just a jar mule tongues, and it should be like not too hard to make. So like, yeah. If I like get a stat, yeah. How many do you need for like just the talisman? Like, can I just do this? Can I make the talisman? That's really good. And now for the ring, I think the ring's like a bit more expensive though. But like, we're gonna want this talisman, right? Okay. How do I make the ring? Sixteen. Oh, yeah, there you go. That makes the ring. And I think for the artifact, you need, like, the full, like, eight stacks. So, like, that's going to cost a little bit of money, but I think we'll be fine, right? So, that's three, four, five, six, seven stacks. And then we're just going to get the last, um, I think, 41. There we go. So, this should make the artifact real quick. There we go. We also just leveled up our carpentry to level 22, which is really good because, I mean, <laughs> yeah. So, now we're at 456 magical power. So that's pretty convenient. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and switch to our Enderman pet real quick and collect from our Blaze minions using our um, Champion Enchanted like AOTD real quick. So I'm gonna like just right click with my AOTD just to kill the Blazes, and then I'm gonna collect from them like this. And it gives like a pretty high amount of combat XP, you know? It's like, that's like very useful, you know? Like, look at all that combat XP like going like up and up and up. But yeah, you really, like, have no point of upgrading the Blaze Minion past 7. Because after that, you'll actually start losing profit, you know? Because, like, those things will, like, only get, like, a tiny bit faster. It's just not worth getting them past 7, you know? If you have just one minion, that's, like, fine. But when you have, like, multiple, you don't want to level them past 7. So I think I would collect from, like, every single one. And we got 6 Enchanted Blaze Rods bringing us at half a stack? No, not yet. We're not at half a stack. But I think if we turn these into Enchanted Blaze Rods... We'll be at 29. So we're not even like halfway there to the Blaze Pet yet. But guess what? Funny thing is, we're not Iron Man. And you know what this means, right? So we have eight. No, we have 73 million coins in the bank. And we have 29 Enchanted Blaze Rods. And since Derpy is Mayor, that means it gives more skill XP. So what if we were to craft the Blaze Pet now? Hmm. So we're going to go into the bazaar and buy um, some Enchanted Blaze Rods. And the problem is, though, it's going to hurt my bank account a little bit. 18 million coins. Ouch. Well, that kind of hurt, but, like, I think it, it was worth it, right? So I just put my diamonds away. I should probably also put that chicken away as well, you know? And, like, the chicken minions should have, like, a ton of enchanted uh, eggs in them. So we're going to take them out. They give a lot of farming XP on top of that. I probably should have equipped my rabbit pet for that, but 
Uh, whoopsies. Yeah, that, that could have, like, given, like, a ton of farming XP. So, yeah, that's seven super enchanted eggs. I believe I only need one. But we should be able to craft the blaze pet now. And hopefully, it's legendary. Alright. The blaze pet. Please be legendary. It was epic. Alright, I guess if it's epic, because we can level it up. And then eventually we can upgrade it to legendary. But, like, we did lose, like, a ton of profit by doing that as well. Which is not good at all. Like, it probably would have been cheaper to just buy the blaze pet from the AH. But, like, currently, like, Derpy's mayor, so we can't even use the AH, even if we wanted to. But, like, what we're gonna do is, we got the blaze pet here. And, remember how I didn't, like, like those, like, bestiary milestones from, like, a long time ago? I think it's called bestiary, actually. Who actually called it bestiary? <laughs> I do, apparently. So, yeah, I do have all of those bestiary milestones I just never claimed. So I'm gonna get like a crap ton of combat XP. Wait, hold up. I wanna hold up my sword and do this just so I can um upgrade the champion enchant because that's gonna be useful. I don't know if it actually works though, but we're gonna see if it does. It's 24 health, 420,000 combat XP, and 30 skyblock XP. Now, if I'm wrong, that should guarantee me a combat level up. Okay, I just claimed that. So yeah, it did actually work. I got upgraded champion six, I got combat 24, and my blaze pet upgraded to level 54. So, like, that's actually not bad. It's at level 54 now. And what we're going to want to do is, like, we're going to, like, try to level it mo up more. Because, like, when we get, like, blaze armor and frozen blaze armor, it's going to be extremely useful, you know. But, um, yeah, kind of unfortunate that, like, we couldn't <laughs> do much with it, you know. So, we still have 56 million coins. I don't know if this will work, but, like, what if we were to try to train the owl pet at fan? Does it, like, actually work? Or, like, do you have to, like, level up the pet manually? Because, like, if it actually works. Oh, you actually. Oh, wait, no. Oh, wait, the owl just makes it go faster. That, that's kind of dumb, you know? So, um, yeah, you, you can't actually, like, level up the owl pet that way, you know? Which is kind of stupid, but, like, it's it's all right, you know? Now, we have 21,000 bits, and, like, we, there's, like, one overpowered thing we can get from the community center, and it's called the Auto Pet Rules 2-Pack, and it's kind of expensive. Like, if you were to get it from the auction house, it's 29 million coins. But, like, it's 21,000 bits. We're going to get one of those. And we can hold and click to consume, and it adds two rules to your auto pet. So, like, auto pet sounds like a pretty cool thing. So, I unlocked it, and I might, might I can now set up up to two rules. So, I guess it's like stackable. So, like, I can just like keep adding more and more rules, but like, right now, I only have two. So, like, yeah, click here to open your pets menu. Okay, so auto pets like over here. So, I can like create rules and stuff, and it is like very interesting, you know. So, I increase my something collection, you kill a mob. You, like, select a dungeon class. Oh, that is, like, actually, like, really, like, useful and stuff, you know? So, like, this one, you start Slayer Quest. I could, like, do, like, the Tarantula one. It says start a Slayer Quest. Wait, can I, like, change, like, the Slayer Quest? It starts. And then I can uh, make it select my Enderman pet. Or, like, my Tiger pet. I don't know. So, yeah, I reached my rules limit. I, I wish I'd get more, but it's fine, you know? So, there you go. So, we're gonna try to start a... Oh, yeah. So, because of Derpy, all these bosses have a lot more health. So, like, instead of having 750, this one has 1,500. This one has 60,000. This one has 1.8 million. And this one has 4.8 million. <laughs> so, like, Tarantula Tier 4 is gonna be, like, kind of annoying to kill. So, yeah, auto petted my Tarantula. And I can just view the rule. So that's, that's really cool. So it should work the way it should, right? So it currently has my tarantula active. So I'm gonna like go ahead and like kill some mobs real quick. It's gonna spawn the boss faster. Oh yeah, and it equipped my Enderman. So that's really useful. And now the boss is dead. It spawns so fast because it's only tier 3. But like, it also like dies pretty quickly. I mean, it looks like tier 4 though. Like, I know it has 4.8 million health, but like, who cares, you know? So yeah, I can't one tap these guys anymore, but like, it's okay, you know? I can still just kill this guy, like, relatively quickly, I believe, you know? My problem is, I'm taking a little bit of knockback, probably because, um, I don't have a shelmet with my Enderman pets. Which I probably should have gotten. Like, what if we, like, make auto pets that equips my tiger instead? There's no command for auto pet. That, uh, that makes me so mad. That doesn't do as much damage, though. At least also, I don't take knockback, because I don't have a shelmet on my Enderman. Which is not very smart of me. Oh, this boss is taking so much longer to kill. But it, it's okay, you know? So that's pretty cool. Because you know, like, auto pet works. And we're gonna change our power to HG as well. So we're gonna be able to kill a boss at hopefully maximum efficiency. Since we do have 65 bonus attack speed now and a tiger pet. So, let's see how this goes. So yeah, I quit my tarantula again, which is very good. We're just gonna keep killing those spiders for now. I'm close to spawning a boss. Oh, there you go. Snack with my tiger. 
See how fast I kill a boss. I kill him, like, pretty quickly. Oh, bro, he's just running around. Are you kidding me? I'm not doing a lot of damage, though. I'm only doing 100k hits, so, like, it's not really much. We're gonna try again. This time, we're just gonna block hit while we're fighting the boss, and, like, hopefully... I think if you block it with a scorpion foil, it activates, like, the plus 250% damage thing. So we're gonna go ahead and try that, right? Block it. I'm clicking so fast. I mean, it's kind of working. Oh. But, like, those bosses die, like, so slowly, though. Because, like, not only, like, they have, like, double health. Like, those swordfish, like, they also get in the way as well. And it's... Let's just say it's, like, kind of annoying, you know? I just said all carry. Oh, well, I guess someone's gonna carry this floor one run, I guess. So, we're in a floor one run. And we only have four people for some reason. Um, I guess one of them is not allowed to join. <laughs> I don't think he has floor one completion or something. But, like, whatever. We're just gonna have to start without him. So, yeah. We're gonna try to play floor one with Derpy being mayor. Because, like, all the mobs are gonna have twice the amount of HP. And it's gonna be very hard, you know? Well, it's gonna be easy. Because there's a guy, like, level, like, 27 or something. Like, I don't know. Goodness, bro. These mobs are like tanks, bro. Okay, this guy still got destroyed. That's because we got, like, the guy who's, like, super OP. Like, pretty much carrying the entire party. You know? I can still want to have, like, some of these guys. We got a lost adventure at 400,000 HP. Okay, we still killed him. Yeah, we're, we're pretty strong. So, like, I don't think we're going to struggle too much. But, like... We're still gonna struggle, like, a little bit more than usual, you know? The dungeon map on the top left of my screen is glitching out a lot, so, like, I don't even know where I'm going half the time. But it, it's fine, you know? Alright, tic-tac-toe. What if I, like, completely go against the cell over here, you know? Okay, I mean, this one, I kind of have to go there. There we go. I didn't even need the solver's help. <laughs> I'm totally doing it without the solver, you know? How are people dying, bro? This is floor one. Ragnarok. He's dead. <laughs> and he's dead again. <laughs> he just died so quickly, bro. Like, he didn't even get, like, any time to, like, even breathe, you know? Hey, that's 50% more skill XP. Wow, bro. So he got 400 just from that floor one. That is nuts. Now, before we end off the episode, we do have our Guardian Pit, which has 78 million XP in Epic. We're gonna try to upgrade it, you know? Now, the like, only problem is, though, I'm out of bits, so, like, I won't be able to upgrade with cat flowers. So, they're probably gonna need to get more bits, you know? Okay, so here we are. We are in Jerry's workshop, and I think that only means one thing. There's another talisman we have to get. And I'm pretty sure it's on top of this mountain. You know? Oh, it's called the Gary Shack. So, we got this chicken guy over here. It said, cluck point one, cluck cock, 33 seconds. Okay. So, I know how this chicken racing works, but, like... Oh, uh, so we're on a chicken. So, we get space bar. We have to get to the hoops. Okay, I see. So that's really cool, honestly, you know? But, like, it's, like, way more skill than the end racing, it looks like, you know? Wait, the timer's going down instead of up. If I run out of time, I got, I got Sherry's showroom. <laughs> One in the world, okay. I might run out of time. Wait, no, I'm gonna make it. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just sent me back. So that's really good. So he gave me a red gift? Wait. Oh, yeah, there you go. I got a red gift. It's in Bazaar, but, like, that's really cool, honestly, you know? So I got a checkpoint two in 52 seconds. All right. What do you mean you abandoned your chicken? Oh, I can't sneak. That's why. It's getting harder. I think we got this easy, though. And boom. There you go. <laughs> 48 seconds. That's under 52, luckily. Or how many of these do we have to do? I got a gift compass. That's not bad. Okay. Cluck point three, let's go. Cool thing I noticed that everything get time you get through a checkpoint or well a cluck point, you get extra time, so that's really cool, you know. Oh oh shoot, almost died. I think if you hit the ground it kills you, doesn't it? Oh, I'm about to run out of time before I make it. One okay, I made it. <laughs> yep, okay, just barely. Oh, I got a I got a frozen chicken. Oh yes. So that's the talisman right there. And now cluck point four. Yeah, I don't think I'm doing that. I just want the talisman. So I don't have four, five, six magical power anymore. Now I have four, six, four. So that's gonna be really good, you know. Like magical power, magical power is OP, you know. And that's what we're in for. So what if I did try to upgrade the guardian pet? Like I don't think it would work though, because I don't have any bids for cat flowers. 
But we're going to try it anyway. Right. Guardian. Lucky block. So I don't know exactly how this works. So like I think we got to like upgrade it to legendary first. And then we got to put the pet item in there. You know. I need 64 enchanted prismarine shards. And it takes care of the guardian pet for five days. Interesting. I could buy it here. But I think my minion already has 64 enchanted prismarine shards. Like it looks like the upgrade cost of the pet is like pretty cheap though. But like. Wait, did my minion already have 64? No. My minion only has 19. Never mind. But, like, I guess I could just grab that anyway, you know? And then we'll just buy the rest, right? There we go. Let's give someone a red gift as well, because, I mean, I don't really want it. Yeah, who am I kidding, bro? I'm just going to sell it. I I'm greedy. And it was fulfilled. So, here we go. Let's upgrade him. So, yeah, there we go. So, it's going to be five days. I can only buy one cat flower just to make it four. I can't get a bouquet, though. Like, it's kind of unfortunate that I can't. <laughs> but, like, yeah, there it goes. So, yeah, there it goes. So, now it's four days, or three days, 23 hours. But, like, it's whatever, you know? So, yeah, I originally thought I was going to AFK a bit. But, honestly, I think I'm just going to leave that for another episode. So, I'm just going to do the outro. So, yeah, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and peace out.